People don't only watch how you win, but they watch how you lose. See, your losing season already showed them that you were victorious. You left a lot of people in awe when you were struggling because it didn't look like you were struggling. You didn't look like what you've been through. You still came out, you still looked nice, you were still happy, you were still laughing. You were still giving other people compliments. You know what happens to evil people when bad things happen to them? They start becoming evil towards other people. They start being disrespectful. They start gossiping. But you, it was the other way around. When bad things started happening to you, you started showing more love. When your money was tight, you were giving when you didn't have. You gave what you didn't have. Your losing season showed people that you were already victorious. See, God won't give you a test that you can't pass. See, when your money was tight, God already knew that you wasn't greedy. God already knew you were a man and woman of God. You had a heart of gold that will help people. He who is faithful over little things will be added on to. God already knew you were going to be faithful when you had a little. God trusts you. He trusted you with the losing season. God can't trust everybody with the losing season. Some people have turned Muslim. Yup. The Christian that went to church every day start losing one day, start losing and everything start going bad like it happened with Job. The next, the next day he's going to be praising Allah. But God knew you had a heart for him just like David. So he trusted you with the testing. He trusted you with the losing season. Just like he trusted Joseph with his losing season. He couldn't trust Joseph's brothers. See, if you look in the Bible, Saul was the first king of Israel and he was given the seat without proper testing. He didn't have to go through a losing season. The people just picked him and said, let's go with Saul. And what happened? Saul blew it. He blew his winning season. So what did God do with David? David had to be in caves fighting his whole life, going through, men, going through a whole bunch of different testings going through a whole bunch of different seasons before the throne was actually given to him. The throne was given to him. He was anointed for it as a child. He didn't see it until he was about 30 years old. But God trusted David with that losing season. He knew that he had a heart for God. People knew you were victorious by how you lost. And God trusted you to give you that losing season. God trusted that you can lose and still love him at the end of the day. You are chosen victorious.